Hey guys, what's up? Seth from Shit here. And uh today I'll be showing you yet another uh human solar panel um light switch thingy. Uh, it works very well. In the middle of the day, you don't need a light in your house because it's plenty bright already from the sun. But when it turns nighttime or when it turns nighttime, you can't see in your house, it's all dark. So there you go. Automatic light right there. You might have heard of a door switch in the background. That's because this thing here um, is the solar panel. Or that's what I call it. Okay, there right there is a villager. He will come out when it is daytime to go adventure. And he will go back inside, which that's a he's he has a tiny little house there because of the door and a roof. And walls, so he thinks it's a little house. So he'll go into his house to hide from zombies, and skeletons, and mobs. So he'll go in there and put that pressure plate, which will power this, which will pretty easily power that, which are all my redstone lamps. Uh, T flip flop to make it so that this is unpowered when this is powered, and this powered when that's unpowered, just so that these aren't on all day. Um, so it's pretty cool. Let's turn the day here. You'll see that he'll go out and adventure. But first, of course, he has to check, make sure there's no zombies and skeletons. So then he'll just walk out of his house. Well, first open his door, then walk out. There you go, there you see it. And with that first plate, that will be powered. So that will, that little piece of ice stone there will be powered for about a millisecond, which will at least power that, which will, um, work to flip flop, which will empower this. And uh, power the, uh, unpower those. So uh, yeah, it's pretty simple to do. Uh, I don't even think I need to make a tutorial for this, but I will anyway, right over here. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna get your block, the block of your choice, and you're going to build a little tunnel for your person. Um, it's very important to use a villager. Uh, I get it in survival, it may be really hard to find them. But um all you have to do is um get an egg. Just use just cheat and get an egg. Who cares? Alright, so there's my little house in me for him. Or his little walkway thingy. Alright, so you're gonna need You need pressure plates. You don't need doors. Or you need a door for his little house. And you're going to need a bed or a half slab, your choice. Um, for this one, I'm actually going to use a slab because uh, I didn't make this very long. So there. And they will think that jumping on the bed or the half slab is a way to get out and go adventure. But it, they really can't, so that's why it works. Um, that's why they will go over there and get on it. Okay. So then, what you're gonna do is you're going to go to where your pressure plates are. You're gonna dig under just like this, and oh, well, there you go. Okay. Put some redstone just like that. Right up here, you're going to place your uh, it's flip flop. Uh, it's pretty easy to make. Just go like that. And place the redstone plates there. And there. And place the redstone there and there. And there and there. Then you're going to set this pressure plate up. And you're going to set it up connected to this one. And over to where your light source is. So my light source is going to be right there. I'm just going to do two blocks this time. Like that, you'll have to just go up, use your Peter, stuff like that. Uh, it's no more difficult. If you know anything about redstone, you can do that part. Alright, so oh, more redstone there. And yeah, you're pretty much done. When uh, well, besides putting the redstone to get in there, 
or the villages. Just like that. Three times we went over there, right? So it worked. And okay, now it's nighttime, right? So I shall go hide from the zombies and skeletons and mobs. Just like that. And there you go. Lights powered. Uh worked perfectly. Uh if you ha you can also make it a little bit bigger. Uh more more um Redstone lamps blanked out there for a second. Your pads are good. Oh, they will help us make pads. Um, yeah, so you can make a, a bigger row like I did over there. Um, it's pretty easy to do. Watch here. Make a bigger row. And, yeah, see the light power. So, uh, yeah, that's how you do it, guys. This is not my creation. This is some other guy's. I'll put his link in the description, link to his channel, so subscribe to him as well as me if you like this. And you can also do this for a trap, so during, so you'd also, you'd have it flipped, um, during day, oh wait, no, you'd have it exactly the same, no, you'd have it flipped, because, so this side would be, um, would not be the side that's powering, this side would be, because when it's day, you, like, if you had, a um, uh, moat of lava and you had like a little bridge like a piston bridge over it that you could cross freely in the day um you could just walk across that but when it turns night when all the mobs come out um that bridge goes away because this um device um turned it off turned off the pistons so yeah that'll work i'll actually show a little clip of that right after this video or actually right now Okay guys, I'm back, and this is what I meant by what I was saying a second ago. Uh, you can make one of these. So during the day, this is down because the only mob that's out there is the creeper. And they're pretty stupid, I don't even think they'll come, um, come on one of these and go across. But, uh, so yeah, it's still the same system. And, um, but you better be careful when it turn, turns out, you better not be stuck on one of these ones. Because guys, gonna go run inside and they're gonna fall into the pit. 